time to review Bloodstrike 27. Now, Bloodstrike, of course, uh, restarted last month, and it's continuous, it continues continues not where it left off so much, but the same kind of story that you've come to know and love, the uh, bloody, gory fighting kind of story. That's what you're going to get in these books. You don't really need to expect any more. But what's going on right now, why I like it, it's done fun and done right. Uh, this thing is the return of the entire Bloodstrike team in a lot of ways. And uh, it's just kind of a quick, a uh, pretty quick read, fun story. Pretty much Cabot fighting a uh, mummy creature things. Uh, best I can say it. Uh, it's what Bloodstrike's always been. It's a, like I said, a really fun, dumb ride. A lot of the extreme image books are that they're bringing back. So when they're done right, they are fun. And so it's just a really quick review because I want to get some out there before I want to get some reviews out there because I know I'm really late on a bunch of them. Uh, but yeah, so Bloodstock 27 I did enjoy. Uh, I enjoyed 26 too. I enjoyed more, uh, enjoyed both of them more than I thought I would. This one I'm going to give a 7.5 out of 10 because it is fun. It's a quick fun ride. And that's really all I can really ask for a blood strike. I'm not expecting a ton, so that's part of it. If you go into these expecting a lot, you're going to hate it. Just because it's blood strike. Any fan of Image knows. Never been a super, like, super great read. But a lot of times it's been a fun read. So if you're looking for just a fun, quick comic, this is one for you. Check it out. See you guys in another review.